We're going to take a look at how you can make a read-only file or file folder within Microsoft Teams. By default, everybody in the Teams and all the channels have access to edit all files. That's part of the effort to make collaboration super simple. But we know that in classes there are times where you'd really like to have that read-only content like your syllabus and other things that you would share that you don't want your students to change your original files. So to do that, we're going to go into files. We are going to select this option here to open in SharePoint. We can go up here to the new button and click new and we're going to make a new folder. Give it our name and then say create. Then to make the change to this folder, all we have to do is right click on it, select details at the bottom of our list. We're going to click on manage access. So then you see there's a few different options here and we can change the access down here for members. Well, right now I want to make sure that all members and all visitors do not have edit access to this folder. So I'm going to click on the can edit option here and say change to view only. And then right here you see we've got visitors. Well, under the visitors, it says that they can view. So by default, visitors are only going to be able to view this. They cannot edit it. You could, if you wanted to switch that, click on this and say allow edit, but we're not going to do that at this point. That's all you have to do to make sure this folder is now a read-only folder for the people in your team. So if we go back to Teams now, and we know that any content that we put into this folder now, all the members of our team will no longer have the ability to edit it, but they will be able to open it up, do a save as, and make their own copy if they'd like. Thanks a lot. Hope this video helped.